Sammy Davis Jr. and Gregory Hines, two of the greatest tap dancers of all time. Sammy Davis Jr. to me was in a class by himself. You know, you had Frank Sinatra, you know, Gregory Hines, and Sammy Davis. Those are my three. There are other great ones out there, but those are my three right there. I pretty much watched all their movies, everything, every, their stage uh, plays, like everything that they did, mostly I watched. And, you know, growing up as a kid, I used to try to tap dance, never was good at it. That's a hard thing to do, y'all. It's not as easy as people think it is. And it's crazy that you don't hear people talk about it a lot anymore. Top dance kind of like faded away. And it's kind of sad. Because it stands. It stands through the you know history of time. And it will always be a part of you know my childhood growing up. And a lot of the people out there. Who adore Sammy J, you know, Davis Jr. So most of this is about Sammy Davis Jr. His, I believe, his 60th birthday, because I believe he died. Uh, I don't know if between eight and ten months after this um, performance by Gregory Hines. You know, he was. This is this was his way of paying his respect to Sammy Davis Jr. The only way you can do it is on stage, and you know, Sammy was kind of. Of sick at that time. He really was. He was in a lot of pain. But just like uh, Chadwick Boseman, they didn't let it get to him. They didn't, they didn't let it, you know, bring them down and make them feel. They didn't want people to feel pity for him. They still went on and did their thing. They still showed up to events, even though they were in a lot of pain. That's why I got a lot of respect for both of those gentlemen. And this, this is heartbreaking to watch. It is. You know, I'm doing this reaction because, I, like I say, I enjoy Sammy Davis Jr. I still do. I still watch him to this day whenever I can. I don't watch a lot of them, but I watch what I can. And Gregory Hines, what can you say? That song he did with Luther Vandross? Mm. Woo, man. Just thinking about it. I'm going to have to react to that. Hopefully, they let me post that up. Just so y'all can see what I'm talking about if y'all never heard that. But, uh, yeah, let's get into this, y'all. It's Sammy Davis Jr., Gregory Hines, 60th anniversary celebration. This was his tribute to Sammy Davis Jr. Let me see where my coffee at. Hold on for one second, y'all. Let me go grab me some coffee. This will give y'all some time to do something right now. Y'all got like two minutes, and I'm right back at it. All right, y'all, let's go. <laughs> warm it up, warm it up. Sammy Davis Jr. So when I was a child, when I was a young boy and I was 10 years old, and I would hear that name, or I would see your name, or somebody would, uh, somebody would talk about you, I would just get so excited, and I would just, I, it's hard to put into words, it's hard to say it, but I just idolized you. And, and, and so now I just, I feel so much love for you that uh, 
going to try to dance it out for you. I'm old school, y'all. This is just me at heart. And this really gets to me because I adore both of these gentlemen. Both of them. Oh my God. Come on, come on. He was sick doing this, y'all. He was very, very sick. He had the energy to get up there on that stage.
。好，我们继续，继续。好，来，我们唱。啊Got him with that think think at the end that uh I guess uh when Dorothy you know tapped her shoes and shit that's wow that was he got him off that he straight killed him off that move for real Gregory Hines ain't had nothing else to do on that one man that that <sighs> it's tough to watch but it's enjoyable man. I'm going to leave it at this, y'all. I'm a little emotional right now. Peace.